there bad fantasies? Yes, there are bad fantasies. Ooh, what kind? Tell and me. the worse they get, the more effective they are for me. I know. My fantasies are horrific. They're nothing I'd ever do in real life. This is the whole point. Absolutely the whole point. I will never forget back in the 70s when I did the first little book, and I had little fantasies that women had written. The sweet one was she dreamt that... Uh, that she died in Roy Rogers' arms <laughs> <laughs> after he'd given her an orgasm. Oh, no, it was come sweet. And go. It was Very sweet. Cute. And then the other one was guilt ridden because she was fantasizing the six Irish cops that broke down her do door and gang raped her. It took me a long time to liberate my fantasies. Absolutely. I think that's why women don't orgasm or they have difficulty. They're just waiting for something to happen. They're not engaging their minds. Their minds are, are judging what's going on in the body. Now, if you're yes. good at orgasm, you can do what they call sensate focus. And I did that a lot in the beginning. I just would focus my mind on the sensations I was getting. Oh, yeah, I've done that. You just feel just, the wave and you just oh, get lost. Oh, it feels it. good. And you know, so you know about orgasm and you know you're going to have one. Mm -hmm. But for women that are looking for one or trying to improve what's happening, they're lying. They're mm -hmm. going, am I getting close? Is this What's it? that? Is this the buildup? Is this How long have I been doing this? this been I don't 20 know. Minutes? What do you think? Is, this, uh, is it going to happen? You know, that mm -hmm. phone call I got the other day from a former client and... It just dawned on me that, you know, she she really wants to have a, a be better orgasm. Mm -hmm. She's having little minor reflexes. So I said, have you ever gone online and looked at porn sites? Like Shufuni, because you never know what's going to get you hot. And it's like, oh, I can go and scan those little squares that they, they give you, what, a minute? Yeah, and you're like, ooh, what's that? Ooh, <laughs> and the little go, <laughs> and then click, next one, oh. A friend of mine was on Shufuni. And she put the clip on the website, and she was watching a clip of uh, a little person, a dwarf man, having sex with an average-sized woman. And she's like, Carlin, it gets me so hot. She'll put it on right before she masturbates, and she's like, it's a Boom. sure fire orgasm. <laughs> she knows time. she's going to get off. Yeah, you can actually have a collection of several that you watch. images. That's why I feel like porn is just a way to fantasize. It helps you unlock and focus, like you said, and yes. then start thinking dirty thoughts. I'd like to have a... It's like a little... A little mini scenario. It's like a little... Yeah, I like a little vignette. And a I, little thing that's happening. I set it up, and if it's going to be a bondage scene, I have to spend time getting the equipment and how it's <laughs> arranged and how we're going to tie this helpless woman down and, and where we're going to... And my hair, where she's going to be situated so when the wild dogs come in, they can <laughs> fuck her and, you know, I mean, awful things like that. And But I design it in my mind, and that's the buildup. Mm -hmm. And sometimes yes. you, you have to roll the story back if you're... Oh, I replay it. It's like, let's go back to that point. <laughs> okay, let's go. Rewind. Back way. Because if you're right in front of an orgasm and you haven't gotten to the hot part of your story, then you have to go back a little bit and come, come into yep, it again. Yep. So we have to give ourselves permission. Forget about PC, politically correct, mm -hmm. incorrect, whatever. Having fantasies is the heart of the creative process. I'm sorry to say that we're not going to have a, a, a podcast, a video cast it's next week. It's my fault. I'm it's, getting yeah. off to the Caribbean. My <laughs> fault. I'm getting off to the Caribbean. I will be slaving over the computer, putting the finishing touches on my memoir. To be released Jan 1. Yes. From New Year. Watch out. And it will be nothing but a series of sexual fantasies for all of you. But, in fact, I lived it all. So, happy fantasies. And the happy holidays, you know, for me, just get it over with. <laughs>